and this man is who you was trusting? First and foremost, I give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father's only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone for teaching us this truth according to the Bible and Ruel. Well. I know the Shalom, the artists and Seer Akim, so at the four corners of the earth, <laughs> pushing this truth through diligence and sincerity. <clears throat> Another Shalom to all you sincere um, listeners, followers, believers. All right, of Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, in truth and sincerity. Shalom to you. I came across this article and I heard something about it. <laughs> You know, on the radio, but it says a uh, fact check, fake Biden tweet. So now the now the tweet's fake, right? It says stereotypes, blacks, black Hispanic Americans. <clears throat> All right. Um, let's get into what he said. It says, and I opened up with, and this is the man you're trusting, right? So keep that in mind. It says the claim Biden tweet tweeted an apology at the same minorities are not able to use the internet president joe biden alleged tried to clarify a statement implying minorities are not able to use the internet on twitter according to a february 20 post facebook post it says the post feature a screenshot what appears to be a rambling tweet filled with grammatical errors sent by the president at 3 53 p.m february 18th my comment regarding minorities not being able to use the internet was taken out of context. Sure it was. It says the tweet states, it's not that they don't know how to use it. It's just that they don't know any better. And that statement just made it even worse for what he's saying. You know what I mean? He takes you, 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 you Israelites, right? You so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans as a joke, as a bunch of dummies. Right, and you can't too have blame them, man. Especially if you voted for him. It says it does not mention to which comment the president is referring, but Biden spoke about the internet assessment during a CNN town hall on February 16th. And this is the man you're trusting, right? And this is the man you voted in, right? Tony was taken out of contact. This man's a liar, man. He's a liar, man. This is uh, Psalms 58 and 1. The wicked are strange from the womb. The wicked is you uh, Edomites, right? <clears throat> Man, woman, and child. It says they go astray. Now you can read about that in Malachi, the first chapter, about who the wicked is. It says they go astray as soon as they be born speaking lies, right? That was just a bunch of lies, man. And that and that's the man you're going to trust, Right? The one that said you, you uh, 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 blacks and Hispanics are not capable of using the internet, right? And then try to go, go, go back and and, and smooth it over, right? Try to smooth it over, and what and what did he say? He said that uh, <laughs> he said that um, where is that? I think I passed it already. Uh, yeah, he said, um, <laughs> it's just they don't know any better. It's just that they don't know any better. That just made it all worse, man. This man is a liar, man. This man does not care about you Israelites, man. Okay? He doesn't care about you so-called Negro, Latino, Native Americans. It says they are like the deaf adder that stop of the ear, which will not hearken to the voice of the charmers charmer so wisely, man. All right, that's that's, that's Edom, right? And, and, and you put your trust in this, man. And the scriptures tell about putting our trust in this place, man, which is... uh. <clears throat> which is spiritually Egypt, right? <clears throat> this is Isaiah 31 and 1. It says, Woe to them that go down to Egypt for help and, and monitor Egypt is America, man. All right? Especially for the hardcore uh, uh, bondage, all right? Captivity, slavery that the Israelites are serving here, man. All right? Working 12 hours, working two to three jobs, right? 
having to work on the jobs and don't have the tools you need to get the job done, but you got to get the job done, right? This is Egypt, man. This is modern day Egypt. So the scripture says, woe to them that go down to Egypt for help, right? Trusting in this man and his government, trusting in the lies. Woe to you, man. It says, and stay upon horses and chariots. So like it, stay upon, stay on horses and trust in chariots because there are many and in horsemen because they look, because they are very strong. Yeah, you trust in this man's uh, 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 system, you know, his military, the power that you see, right, that America has throughout the four corners of the earth. And you trust in that, right? Verse 31, it reads on. Uh, chapter 31 reads on, but they look not unto the Holy One of Israel, neither seek the Lord. Right? So, one to you who don't seek the Lord, man, who don't put your trust <clears throat> in the Lord, man. That's what it's about in these last days. Not, you know, <clears throat> seeing what the next president's going to uh, do for you. Right? We're supposed to be trusting in the Lord, man. Because the scriptures tell you that what this place is going to, um, <clears throat> and Amos 9 8 is going to be destroyed, man. Okay, it's going to be destroyed from off the face of the earth. But uh, let's get, um, let's talk about some songs. Let me see something. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, this is Psalms 55, 21. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter. You see how he tried to cover up what he was saying? Right? But you Israelites are looked at as a proverb and a byword, man. You know, the scriptures tell you that. You know? It says, Psalms 55, 21. The words of his mouth. Whose mouth? Esau, Edom. The so-called white man. Were smoother than butter. See, he made that, that statement, you know, about you Israelites. You know, and you know you're gonna you're gonna forgive, you're gonna forget, you 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 you're going to uh 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 not uh you're gonna you're not gonna let what he said get to you, you know he's gonna still be your president, you know. But this man nothing but a liar, man. And he sh and, and this and this devil shows you how he really feels about you, man. And here it is, a lot of you Israelites are going to be blinded by what he says. It says, Psalms 55 and 21, the words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. Yeah, war is in this man's heart, man. He's trying to jab each and every one of you Israelites, man. That That's just what's on the, 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 the books right now, man. And ultimately hit you with the other jab, the MOB. All right, it says, his words were softer than oil, yet were they drawn swords. See, this man... Is at the end of his of, of his uh, uh ruling, man. Right of him, um, uh, uh, you know, being in rulership. So he's gonna try to uh, take you Israelites out, man. And he's gonna lie, do whatever he has to do to pull the wool over your eyes, man. Okay. Stop trusting in Esau, Edom. Stop trust, which is the so-called white man. Stop trusting this man's system. Right. Because he's nothing but a liar. This man is nothing but a liar and he's not going to change. Matter of fact, we'll end it off on that. Um, let me see, I spelled it wrong. Let me see. All right, let me word it this way. This is Jeremiah 13 and 23 says, Can the Ethiopian change his skin or a leopard change his spots? Then may ye also do good that is accustomed to do evil. See, this man was created to be evil, man. Esau, Edom, we was created to be the righteous, the Israelites, the so-called Negro, Latino, Native Americans. All right? 
So this man is not going to be in your best benefit, man. He's not going to change. You cannot change this devil, man. All right? So stop trusting him. Stop trusting him what he has prescribed for you, which is ultimately death. Okay? And return back to your how about shimmy. I will shout the world because God and Jesus Christ, man. Till the next time I say, and it starts with repenting for your wicked acts, man. Till next time I say, Shalom.